Hi everyone, I'm Prof O. In this video, I'm going to briefly introduce virtue ethics. Virtue ethics is one of the three major approaches in normative ethics, the other two being deontological and consequentialist. Normative ethics are a branch of philosophical ethics that deal with questions about how one ought to act in a moral sense. Virtue ethics can be identified as one that emphasizes moral character, or virtues, as opposed to duties and rules, as with the ontology, or that emphasize consequences or outcomes, as with consequentialism. Virtue ethics is a broad term for many different theories that emphasize the role of character in moral decision making. A virtue ethicist may advise that you act as a virtuous person would act in your situation. In the West, virtue ethics is most associated with Aristotle and Plato. Nicomachean Ethics is Aristotle's best-known work on ethics, and it is considered one of the most important historical philosophical works. According to Aristotle, we study ethics to improve our lives, and its principal concern is human well-being. Similar to Plato and Socrates, Aristotle takes virtues to be central to a well-lived life. As virtue ethics is person rather than action based, it looks at the virtue or character of the person performing an action. A virtue is a trait or quality in a person that is deemed to be morally good. It can be said that a good person lives virtuously and possesses and lives the virtues. There are many different lists for virtues, but I will highlight two of the most well known. Probably the best known list of virtues might be the four cardinal platonic virtues, wisdom, courage, moderation, and justice. In Nicomachean ethics, Aristotle discusses 11 virtues. They are courage, temperance, liberality, magnificence, magnanimity, proper ambition, truthfulness, wittiness, friendliness, modesty, and righteous indignation. There are a number of really common objections to virtue ethics. I will briefly summarize a couple. One is that the theories are too self-centered or self-concerned, in that they are inward-looking and that they fail to sufficiently take into account the extent to which our actions affect other people. Another is that the challenge of virtue ethics is that it does not provide a framework for guiding actions. There are not codifiable principles that can be applied. And even within virtue ethics, there is disagreement over what exactly virtues are, what are virtues, what are not virtues, as well as how can we even define what a virtue is. This was only a very brief introduction to virtue ethics. There is a ton more to cover for a more comprehensive approach. However, this should provide you with a little bit of background on what exactly virtue ethics is. It is a very rich area of discussion and debate. Thanks for watching.